Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Obit of Data. Welcome back to Galactic Mining Corp. As ever, in the downtime between episodes, I've been busy. I've accumulated a decent chunk of change, as you can see up in the top left-hand corner. Uh, I've also accumulated a good number of shards. Again, nothing particularly interesting. Uh, all I've done is, I guess, mined a couple of the planets out. Uh, we haven't done anything in the, the beta quadrant yet. We're still waiting to, to move on with that. I suggest we probably go into the Coratorium, have a little look at some of the upgrades that we can get, including the HQ size increase. That's pretty, that's pretty great. What do we got out this way? XP rate, drill power. I really like the idea of drill power. And to be honest, we can probably get one, two, three, four. Not quite... Explore cost reduction, explore cost reduction. Give me, give me these two. Give me these two. So that's going to be uh, between them a 10% cost reduction in exploration. I really, really, really do want to do uh, a bit of exploration. I also want to make sure that I have fully upgraded all of my people. There we go. Excellent. And 26,000, 58,000, and 15,000. So that's going to be, that's going to be grand. We did spend about 200k on that, but that's okay. Uh, navigation control, let's swap that into the mix. We'll get that built as quickly as we possibly can. We will check out the garage, even though I am certain that I still don't really want to... Have I been using this drill the whole time? I really don't want to be. Yeah, this drill is way better. Uh, okay, yeah, I want to leave. I want to leave this drill uh, drill on for now. I don't really want to go to the next drill. It, it just seems like totally, totally, totally unnecessary. Let's just leave the current drill on, and if we want to change things up, then uh, then we will. Uh, there's also a bunch of research to be done. Hey, look at that. Let's uh, let's do the research, and we'll get a fire chamber. In fact, we might even be able to get the room after this as well. Ooh, very, very close. Very, very close indeed. Nothing on the second page yet. I'm pretty sure there's nothing on the second page quite yet but whatever the heck this is the vault oh man that's 100 drill power 100 hp that's real good that's real good we want to we want to get that if we can fire chamber we will build it even though it's not as good as the vault i mean i should really just i should really just hang on i should just hang on i should get like I don't know, fossilized roots. Why don't we track track fossilized roots? We'll we'll go and do we'll go and do something. We'll get fossilized roots. Oh. That's another room. An ice chamber. Um Oh, straight up icy. So it, it just gives us uh it gives us ice resistance as opposed to fire resistance. Okay, that's kinda cool. The vault is still better, and um we're still still far better off uh doing that. I haven't increased chest value or or anything like that. We we can we can go and make that happen in a little bit. The collection could probably do with being upgraded. Yep. Again, not really convinced that I need any of these upgrade points. In fact, I mean I've never really used them at all for anything, really. There we go. Lots and lots of levels. Yeah, I've got 86 of these upgrade points. I guess it's nice for the XP. I am getting a lot of HP. I am leveling up my corp, which is which is wonderful. That's good. Okay, so that leaves us with what? Roughly 600k to do uh, a couple of things. The first thing that I want to do, uh, I need to get more copper tint, apparently. Oh, yeah, the other thing that I was going to chat about. Uh, we need to we need to look at crew contracts. We need to, to look at getting more crew. And I think we're all we can't we can't do this one. We don't have petrified wood not yet. Anyway, this one is a bit of a it's a bit of a challenge to to get. Uh, Bobby Joe, Bobby Joe is also a challenge to get. But we're gonna try and get fossilized roots. Ink jetted. Yeah, ink jetted we can do and we can do fairly easily. So we need inferno stone, polar stone. Pure copper. Yeah, I, I would like to get. I would like to get. Uh, I would like to get you. Okay, Inferno Stone. Pure copper. Let's uh, let's see if we can try and find a place for just that. Volcanoid. I think we might need Volcanoid as well, but that's it's fine. Uh, right, sharp, bright. Nope. We are after pure copper. And also. Inferno Stone. Devil's Horn, Krakus, 
Costo. Let's go, let's go Krakus. Let's go Krakus. Uh, so that allows us to hit uh, two birds with one stone. Uh, I don't need to do any... I don't need to do any, uh, any coring of the planet here. We've actually managed to get it all already. But if we undertake mining operations here, maybe see if we can try and get a nice little, uh, a nice little chunk of change that will stand us in good stead moving forward. A little bit of bread as well. Pretty sure that bread was also required for whatever it is that we were after. So let's make sure that we open all of the crates that we possibly can. Hit up. Hit up everything that we need to hit up. I also need to make sure that I'm uh, properly investing my resources. There we go. My crits are... My crits are feeling... My crits are feeling very fresh. And that's nice. 20% HP I will take. Oh, that was close. And copper, copper, cheese stone, copper, great, let's go. How on earth did I manage to get to the... How on earth did I manage to get to the bottom of this moon? I have no idea. Uh, I think we need 50 pure copper. I Did I only get one inferno stone? Really? That is very, very surprising to me. I guess it's not super, super common. Why we need to make sure that we hit the explodey things as often as we can. And we also need to try and get ourselves a good amount of visibility. So we can see what the heck is going on. Boom. I don't I don't see any of this uh this darn inferno stone. It looks looks like a bit of a mystery. At least the pure copper is fairly easy to come by that's good anyway yeah investments i want to do i want to do i want to finish exploring this quadrant and i want to see if we can properly start on the uh on the next quadrant to be honest right uh we'll leave we'll leave that there we'll leave that there and uh we'll we'll continue onwards let's go back to explore and contracts yeah 50 copper Inferno stone. Track Inferno stone. Track glow sticks as we already are. And we shall have a look at investments whilst we're here as well. Okay. Extra crit strike. Extra drill HP. I mean, we can actually do all of these things. Or auto cash. I think I'll take... I think I'll take extra crit strike. That seems pretty good. I want to see if we can try and get another drill on the go. An extra drill on the go would be great. The drill stats are in a good place at the moment, but they're not great. Odin, Vulcanoid, Inferno Stone. Taco, that doesn't look much like a taco to me. Now, I tell you what, we might actually, we might actually be able to, might actually be able to get what we're looking for here, but let's not, let's not faff around too much. Again, if we're going to get a contract, which I think is freaking important we need to we need to do it we need to be careful uh we can upgrade pure copper that's that's grand that is grand very very happy to do that what did i say glow sticks yeah Ooh, bread loaf nice glow sticks chili bean the other chili bean the other and also inferno stone let's go do let's go do odin we'll get a bunch of inferno stone real quick this seems like a much better place to get Inferno Stone. Look at all this Inferno Stone. I mean, it is it is an awful place to, to operate, but if it gives us what we're looking for, especially in one pass, that would be that'd be great. There we go. I think it was like 50 Inferno Stone that I needed, but don't quote me on that. Again, it's a little bit of a it's a little bit of a pain in the backside to you know to work to get these to get these resources, but I mean, the whole point of doing it is that it's going to give us a new uh, a new crew member. And when you think of the value that a crew member brings to the to the ship, I mean, it kind of makes kind of makes sense. Kind of makes sense, and it makes it all worth it. Right? Illuminates nothing. Not that I can see anyway. Aha! Got what we're looking for. Nice. 
Uh, I could maybe try to dive deep here, actually. I didn't initially think that I could, but yeah, we're making we're making some pretty decent progress. I'll take the elemental shield, hopefully before the enemy is able to destroy me. And we'll continue to move down. Until I get destroyed by the enemy. Alright, that's uh that's fine. You know what? Go to HQ, go to HQ. Let me see what's well, come on in, partner. Well, come on in, partner. Yeah, let me let me see let me see what it actually is. 25? That's infuriating. Okay, I'm I'm not I'm not gonna I'm not gonna faff around with that contract. If we get it, then we get it. That's great. Uh, but I want to I want to check out research here. What do we need? More extreme cola. More turf. More fossilized roots. We are so close to all of these things. Volcanoids. Inferno stone is a wee ways away. Okay, you know what? Let's not let's not faff around. Let's not faff around. We're, we're ten minutes in already. Obviously, we want to work on the upgrades, but let's actually do exploring. Exploring is kind of important. Right. Uh, there's got to be something down here. There's got to be something down here. Let's, uh, let's have a little have a little look. Okay, that is a super weird looking planet. Market stock. Excellent. That's good. Investigate that. We'll come back for the market stock in just a second. I'm really enjoying the uh, the cost decrease of this. Oh, that's spiky boy. And another crew contract. Can we do it? <gasps> we can do it immediately. Oh, that's brilliant. That is excellent. Drill bit. Congratulations. Welcome to the team. What do we got? Market stock. What do we got in the chest? Uh, nothing too, too interesting. Look. A uh, little game controller thing there. Research facility. Yep. Crew contracts. Uh, corkscrew. Swampium. Caustite. Green goo. I mean, we can do everything here with the exception of Swampium and uh, Corkscrew. Oh my goodness. Investment opportunity. Drill power for 20,000. I mean, yeah, we'll, we'll end up investing in this, obviously. I wonder what the max level of... Uh... Oh, wow. Uh, I want to know what the max level of investments actually is. Crew contract. Burgers. Midnight rain. Okay, all right, that's not bad. That's pretty good, in fact. Okay, uh, let's drill some of these. Let's drill some of these moons. Let's just get the let's get the research done. I want to. I want to get to work on the research. Uh, it's also yeah, midnight stone. That's actually kind of required for something, isn't it? That is. We're definitely going to be able to do at least one of these levels here. I mean, we have a really, really good drill, especially with the, the crit strike that we've got going right now. It's it's pretty great. There we go. Right, get this out of the way. We'll push this moon as far as we can, I think, just because, I mean, why not, right? We'll push it as far as we can. Let's not bother with doing too much additional work here, because we can always just, uh, we can always just end. I'm going to conduct my drilling operations inside this jellyfish. Then I'll explode faster, and then we can immediately jump into a, to another little, uh, another little, another little attempt here. 82.8 kilometers. That's rare. That's the... Oh, that's not good. Yeah, that is a rare type of stone. The, the vein stone. I think it's called or bright vein something like that it's uh not super not super common therefore pretty valuable that we pick it up whenever we see it uh we do need research can't forget about research also need to open a few more chests just to try and discover what our third item is on this planet which i don't think would be too difficult to do there we go in fact are we going to be able to get down to the down to the level at the bottom of the world here or down to the shard at the bottom of the world i should say um, probably not at this rate. Oh, we've just done it. Just managed. Excellent. You know what? The the additional cores, quite handy. Very, very handy indeed. Okay, that's Grant. And we're going to go one more time because we still need one additional item. 
So we need to make absolutely darn sure that we open up all of the chests that we possibly can, and we get ourselves the Midnight Stone as well. Boop. Uh, yep, get that. And keep going, keep going, keep going. Research complete. Research complete, that's what we're talking about. I, could I win this? I, I doubt it, I doubt it. Very big doubt that we could actually finish this level. It's more fish. Really? I'm surprised that we've not come across the... the other item here, but... Oh, well, there we go. There's literally nothing around us, as far as I can see. Uh, that's fine. That is absolutely fine. Let's check out the crew contracts. 75 Midnight Rain and then Burgers. Okay, alright. That's that's definitely something that we can do. Let's 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 go. Let's absolutely go. Midnight rain. That's uh, that's what it's called. And it would be good, as I say, just to get that done. But I'm not gonna spend the entire time chasing over crew contracts when I've got, you know, plenty of money to spend, investments to do. We've got a drill to find as well. There's gotta be another drill in this quadrant somewhere. I intend to find it. Go. And keep going, keep going, keep going. Still nothing nothing in these uh these core areas or in these little uh these little spaces on the way down to the core. This is gonna be a failed mission, failed mission for sure, but uh but it's fine. Uh, okay, let's, uh, let's, again, I'm getting a little bit, I get a little bit waylaid here. Let's do some of the other comets and moons. Monster infestation inbound. Hey, look at that. Oh, full sapphire as well. We need full sapphire for something. Oh, wait, hold on. This is a dark planet. I don't think that we have resistance for this. Right, well, I'm very, very curious to see how this works. We got 48 kilometers to go down. It's quite deep. This is why this is why I feel vindicated in moving on because there are other bounties on other planets to explore. Nailed the first one. It's a cool little effect at the bottom of the screen. There we go, get the multiplier, get the Get that, get that. Let's see what we've got in store here. Screw, what about a corkscrew? I'm really looking for a corkscrew. Burger, that's also kind of required for something. I can't remember who it was, but this seems like a pretty, this seems like a pretty good planet, to be honest. I don't think I've ever been down here. Uh, I will take the 20%. We can try the next level, the next depth level, that is. But I'm I'm pretty certain I know exactly how it's gonna go. And we'll hit our research if we can. We cannot. Irritating. Right, burger bolt and a thread. Totally fine. Research complete. Research complete. Brilliant. You jerk hole. Burgers, please. I would love some burgers. Oh, I thought it was a health recharge station. Oh, that's a darn embarrassment. Right, we are getting deep. Very, very deep. Okay, uh, there, there is very little chance of me being successful in hitting level 2 depth here. But you know what? I'm an optimist. One of these days, we might get lucky get an actually decent get an actually decent room there I'll tell you what that wasn't that wasn't half far off that wasn't that wasn't far off at all uh, let's retreat out to the map and let's check out one of these new planets as well again keep on keep on exploring always be exploring that's what I always say always be exploring I really don't like these mushroom thingies 
I really don't. They make everything so much harder. That's brand new. That radish thing that we just got in the in the crate is just brand new. I'm almost certainly going to explode if I if I go over to that uh, to that nice little chunky bonus there. Don't know why I'm bothering to get boost when I don't need it. We can head down here, even though it's not gonna not gonna work particularly well. Moss mud. Uh, you know what? This is a sucky planet. This planet sucks. This planet sucks. Oh, I do need to do the research though. I forgot about that. I do need to do research, but because it's a reasonably middlingly sized planet, it shouldn't take too long to get research. There we go. And it is something that I do want to do. It gives me an opportunity just to collect a whole bunch of bricks anyway. I don't know if we've hit the research objectives for all of these. But certainly getting the levels and also the research objectives would be quite nice. Any, any research? Nope. But dynamite is good because that means almost certainly guaranteed research. There we go. And some goo. We do need goo for, for one of these contracts. I'm pretty sure anyway. Multiplier, visuals. Oh my goodness, there's just nothing. There's just nothing. There's nothing at all. Could I please get uh, get some research tiles? All right. Well, if we don't get it, then if we don't get any, if we don't get any research tiles, then we're not going to be able to. We're not going to be able to do anything. I'm afraid. Boop, and boop. Yeah, nice. Still no, still no real research. Okay, all right, that's fine video game. If that's what you don't wanna, you don't wanna give me research, I'm, I'm perfectly happy to back off and go and do a comet. And then also that really weird looking planet up north. Right, 48 kilometers here. I think that we can probably get down to the bottom, especially if there's no monster infestation here. We'll get the research as well, because it's a comet, it's actually very, very quick for us to get the, the research. Yeah, we can't drill those blocks. I just thought it would be quite nice if I could drill the blocks, because that would be an extra type of block that we could get, basically, for free. Gold multiplier. I'll yoink it real quick. And we will press onwards. Good stuff already. Already a good chunk of the way there for the research. Might even be able to do the next Comet level, to be honest. And let's not worry about the health. Nice. Alright, whatever. It's good to get the research. Good to get the research tokens that we're getting right now, but... Uh, okay, it was miserable. Not even gonna bother trying to hit that crate there because I know we're not gonna get it. Right, whatever. End the mission. End the mission. Give me a give me a little uh, a little redo. Still haven't discovered the second or the third uh, the third item that we can get from this vicinity, which is kind of nice. All right, the core is down south. I, I'm aware. Oh my lordy, the enemies! heck is happening here see i still think that we're in with a reasonably decent chance of getting to the core just depends on the last couple of rocks here health is draining quickly but we have a very very large health pool research complete that's brilliant love to see it and then i guess i'll go and just destroy myself on there we go. On uh, on those tiles over there. Okay, let's not push it any further. We've managed to somehow climb back up to 400,000 in the intervening time. Right, what do we got here? Brand new planet, brand new world. We got some pure copper. These don't look like new tiles. They, uh, they look like standard tiles. Let's open some crates. Blue paint, nothing... Nothing new and or fancy there. 
Doesn't look like we've got any enemies. Doesn't look like the... Doesn't look like the elements are altogether too bad. Research, obviously. Yep. We'll do it. Let's uh, speed down. There we go. No issues at all getting here. Brilliant. And zip up, zip up. Nab that. Cool. What a breeze, indeed. What a breeze. What a what a breeze it was to get to the course. Such a breeze, in fact, that we're gonna we're gonna roll it right back. Banana and blue paint. I didn't see the banana the banana be acquired, but I presume that it came from the core. If I didn't see it be acquired, that's usually where the uh, they come from. Bananas come from the core. That's right. You heard it here first. Okay, a little bit of extra research needs to be done, and we should have no difficulty doing that on the way down, especially if we get offered one of those. That'll probably just take us across the line by itself. Now, I am somewhat doubtful that we're actually going to get to the core with, uh, with this level of this level of environmental nonsense going on. Oh, we did. Oh, that was a shame. That was an absolute... That was a big old shame. Um, if I'm a little bit more sensible, then we can absolutely do this. It is... It is just a little... Oh, we can't say no. Oh, that was an ice cream there, I think. Was that our third item? Looks like it. Okay, can't say no to that cash. And we shall wait until we're down here. Good stuff. Keep going, keep going, keep going. More boost. Yes, please, I'll take it. Let's continue to boost down as far as we possibly can. Nice. Okay, definitely going to be able to do it this time. Got enough HP on the, on the cards. And I was going to see if I could get that multiplier right across there. But that's cool. All right, more core fragments. We'll go to the map. I think that was the last planet that we needed to get to. Right. Can we, by any chance, do any of the contracts? No. We need more burgers. Uh, we can do this one. That's not a million miles away either. This one is still uh, a bit out of our grasp, but that's fine. Okay, let's go. Let's go back to the HQ. We'll see if we can try and get an upgrade, or not an upgrade, should I say, uh, a research. Let's get a research thing done. Oh, petrified wood. We now have petrified wood. That's kind of good to know. I'm gonna take cheese stone because I don't think we need cheese stone for anything. There's so many freaking upgrades here. Yeah, let's not throw. Let's not throw any any more upgrades uh, in there quite yet. Ice chamber, no vault, yes, that is absolutely what we want to do. Any crew upgrades? Yeah, nice, 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 nice. Drill power plus five, always good to see. You upgraded, you upgraded, acid resistance. Kind of hate that, but whatever. Let's get the core upgraded as well, or the corp upgraded. Hey, a brand new member of staff, and presumably you will be very happy to sit in the vault. And you can also sit in there. Nice. Is that everyone assigned? I should have perhaps assigned that person before, but at the end of the day, it doesn't particularly matter. Okay, let's go into the Coratorium again. Where's our next HQ upgrade? Ice resistance, research coin amount. What the heck is a research coin amount? Auto earner speed? That's kind of funky. I think we go here, 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 right? We can get these two right now. Research coin amount. Hmm. Is this fire resistant, chest value, auto earner, crit strike chance, crit, crit strike? I suspect that that crit strike chance is probably super valuable. But I, I guess we'll we'll just have to wait and see. Uh, nothing in the garage that I really want to do. To be honest, I think what we probably want to prioritize is just getting... Well, getting some cores done if we can, but probably more importantly, finishing the exploration. Doing a little bit of extra. Doing a little bit of extra something, something. Oh, 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 oh. I was going to check the market. I was going to check the market. That is what I was going to do. What do we got? XP. Purchase this crate and you'll find it whilst drilling. Break the crate uh, to obtain a boost of XP for your crew. 
Yeah, now that's a grand old point and something that I should really consider. So what do we really want you to do? Light radius increases the radius of light around your drill. Cores will explode an additional time. Cash multiplier plus 20%, drill speed increase. Tile gap increase. Drill sites will have more gaps in the tiles. Uh, I'm gonna take cash multiplier. Yeah. What do you currently do for us, bud? Cash multiplier plus 20%. It's pretty decent. Tile gap increase, power up chance, core item pop, death harvest. Yeah, maybe. Chest cash increase, light radius, monster damage reduction. Eh. Drill cash generator. You're, you'll generate cash whilst drilling. Chests break quicker. I uh, yeah. I'm gonna take you, and then I'm gonna get uh, I'm gonna get you instead. Yeah. So I think this is I think this is pretty good. I think this is pretty freaking good. A good setup, I think. Whether it is or not, we shall we shall see. Okay, let's let us explore. We're gonna we're gonna finish off the north, I think. Head up here. I'm so glad that I got that explore cost reduction. Oh my goodness, it's Burger World. What the heck is Burger World? Nice. Research. Okay, any investments that we want to do? Destructo Dome. I will take the Destructo Dome once because that's all the science tokens we have to, to do that. Market stock. Nice. What's the market stock? Chest. Uh, okay. It's a lot of good, lot of good stuff that we're doing here. Uh, let me head back home, see what's in the market. What is this? Break the crate and generate a large horizontal line. That's really cool. I'll take the XP for now. I'll take the XP for now. Let's go back to the explorer. We'll do like, I don't know, like two planets or something. Uh, what world is it? These two worlds. Yeah. Quidgy. Quidgy. Okay, there's still a little more to explore, weirdly, in this, uh, in this world. There's still a little more to explore. XP. So that gives XP to my crew. It might be worth it if I get crew XP bonuses to rotate the crew around a little bit. Same with moving them from... From, uh, from bad buildings, or I guess buildings that have a lower XP modifier, we can change them, move them into buildings with a higher XP modifier. Right, keep on going, keep on going. That was very, very easy. Uh, Cash-wise, I don't know why, but we seem to have done pretty darn well for ourselves. There we go. Do chests really break quicker? I know that I, I know that I uh, put somebody on board who did break chests quicker, but it doesn't seem to have made much of a difference. Let's get a boost here. Nice. And continue to boost down. I think that we're probably going to just naturally be able to get the, the research mission. Uh, the research mission completed. So that's good. There we go. Keep on exploding. Man, I love those crits. Man, I love those crits. Uh, we might even be able to get to the next core level here. Oh, that was handy. I think we're going to be able to get research done, and I also think that we're going to be able to get the core level. Brilliant. Are we able to do one more? Are we able to do one more adventure by any chance? Yes, all the dynamite. Yes, please. Okay, let's uh, let's finish, and let's uh, let's go one more time. Let's throw it. Let's throw it in. I love I love missions like this. I love planets like this where we're just able to where we're just able to make you know ridiculously quick progress because our drill feels so freaking powerful. Double dynamite can't resist the opportunity to take a double dynamite. 
Now, we're probably not going to be able to get to the core on this one unless we get really lucky with HP. Or crits. Ah, whatever. Now we're about halfway, thereabouts. XP, I'll take XP. Good stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, let's go and max out our HP here. Good stuff. Full health. Now, that, crazy as it sounds, might not be enough to guarantee us the win here. We're going to boost so that we have to put up with this acid less. 98 kilometers. It's deep. It's really deep. Oh, we're three tiles away. Uh, truth be told, I'm not convinced that we're going to be able to that we're going to be able to finish that one. Instead, let's head the let's head to Burger World. See see what's in Burger World. Fossilized roots. I know we need. Burger World is is big. Burgers. Shock. We get burgers as the item. That is really very, very unsurprising. Is it just burgers that we get? <laughs> Hilarious. Okay. More burgers? More burgers. Right. Fairly certain that we're going to manage to hit the core on at least one of these levels. Uh, don't know if that increases our elemental resistance permanently. Or if it's just temporary. If it's just temporary, it's a bit lame. All right. Planet Burger Worlds has been has been done very, very easily. Let's redo and uh, let's go again. Big burgery planets are good to do because the bigger the planet is, the more uh, core shards we get, which just makes my life a heck of a lot easier. Right, well that was a fortunate crit. Probably saved me a little bit of a little bit of HP from those monsters there. There we go. Let's not. Ah. <laughs> what burgers? More burgers? Mm, it's gonna be close here. Yeah, it was just off the screen there. If I had had less of a less of a daft relationship with those. I didn't mean to do that. If I had less of a daft relationship with those uh, with those enemies on that level, then we would have we would have won. That is to say, if I crashed into them less, I would have won. Nice. Let's go. Let's go this way. Let's nab uh, nab some more burgers. Who'd have thunk it, eh? All right, halfway there. No real issue. Uh, could do with a little bit of additional HP, though. That's what I'm looking for right there. Nice. Elemental shield, totally freaking useless. Because there is no element to be afraid of here. Oh! Snuck right down. Excellent. Burger world, thou hast been conquered twice. Uh, we're not going to try it a third time, because I feel like that is just ridiculous. Alright. New core located. I mean, how can a planet have more than one core? I, I frankly have no idea, but apparently it does. Okay. Uh, contracts, what do we got here? Hey, hey, look at that. Freshman. Brilliant. Any more? Copper bars. A lot of people need copper bars for some reason. Don't know why. Yeah, you're definitely not getting done anytime soon. Okay, HQ, 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 HQ. We got 33 cores, and I tell you what... It's not quite enough. Auto earner speed plus 100. Not quite enough. We need, what, 10 more? Yeah, exactly 10 more cores for a, for an HQ upgrade. Like Pretty good. That, huh? Market, we need to nab this. Need to nab that. Then we need to go to research. And to be honest, I think that we just try and bang out as many of these 
as we can, even though I know it's going to cause some issue down the road uh, with our contracts. What do we need? Bolts, straw, polar stone. Yeah, we need way more polar stone, actually. Got no polar stone. But to be honest, I'm happy with everything with everything progressing at this rate. It's, uh, it's very, very good. How much, how much is our auto earner? Can I go to the office and have a little look? Okay, drill power is fine. Drill HP is fine. Obviously, nothing that I can really do about that. Chest cash increase is 20%. Eh. Auto earnings is 7,000. Does that give me an... Is there an auto earner... An auto earner, earner time? I have no idea what the time actually is. Tiles found. Tiles upgraded. Achievements. That's good. Stats progression. Lots of achievements. Can't really be too displeased with that. Uh, okay, uh, where do we have to explore? Probably up in this vicinity here. Dare say that we can probably... Oh, look at that. Visit the drill hangar. 1,200 science to, to nab this drill. All right, we can do it. Bananas suck. That's pretty good, though. Okay, all right. What do we got here? Nothing. Nothing. No intel. Absolutely no intel. But it is a pink colored... It is a pink colored planet. So what does that mean for us? Uh, hard to say. I am completely unsure. What I do know is, is that I need more cores and therefore any level 1 planets will get immediately... Immediately dealt with. I'll just boost. There we go. In fact, we may even be able to... We may even be able to just straight up do this three times in a row. Might be somewhat optimistic, but it's worth a crack. What do we got to get to? 63, 63 kilometers. And also research. We can get the research done too. Okay, good. Bananas. And keep boosting. Already down at 50 kilometers or thereabouts. Research. No element to worry about. Research is done. Brilliant. You know what? I think we might be able to do this three times in a row, which would be grand. How many shards did we did we get last time? Sushi. Okay. We got four cores. So I needed ten more. If we get four times three, that's twelve. I mean we should be we should be absolutely a-okay, right? Okay. Just chunking away. If we get one health boost on the way down, I think we're going to guarantee it. Uh, we're going to guarantee victory here. But even if we don't get a health boost, we'll still probably be fine. The light radius of uh, of this little ship is a, a bit sad. A bit sad, i got to be honest. Nothing. Gold multiplier. That was a bad decision, wasn't it? Yeah, um, roll, roll it back, roll it back. Give me, give me another chance. Give me another chance here. The other thing that we need to do is we need to go to the shop. We need to check out what that latest uh, item was that we, that we unlocked. I should not do the, yeah, the evil looking tiles. That's pretty good. Go, 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 go. Right, the pink tiles are fine. The purple tiles are best if we can hit them. It's excellent. That's the worst tile to hit. Pink. Pink. And that's it. It's just that simple. Alright, I think that's going to give us pretty much everything that we could possibly need. go. I'll take the XP and I'll take the cash multiplier as well, just for good measure. I think that we've got pretty much everything that we could possibly need from this planet, so I'll just... Yep. 
drive a little bit further. And we will go to map here because I don't quite want to head home yet. Max that out. We need way more science in order to in order to do in order to do that. Let's drill gimbal. Again, we're still looking for like, ways to get a couple of things. I was a way to say a uh, fool's sapphire or fool's gold, whatever the heck this is. Uh, we need a more reliable way to get that because we need it for research. We also need it for a couple of contracts. I'm delighted that we finally got an opportunity to get it slightly more reliably than previously. Also, I really like crits. All right, you know what? I'm going to just sack this run. Yeah. Oh, actually, that reminds me. I do have a couple of things that I need to unlock in the shop. One is the horizontal beam, which seems pretty cool. Oh, I said I was going to sack this run, but this might end up being a, a winning a winning run anyway. Absolutely. Wow. On planets where there's no environmental nonsense, we're just freaking cruising. We are cruising. Oh, look, the horizontal beam thing. This is the... It's the first time that I've seen it. I didn't think that I'd unlocked it from the shop yet. That's fine. Uh, let's drill again. I think that I might even be able to get to level 2 there. If I don't hit the... Ah. Uh, if I don't hit the enemies, then I will, I will have more success. It's pretty much just that simple. Don't hit my crate. Okay, boost, boost past these chumps, boost past these chumps. We're about to hit the research as well. Oh my lordy. Right, down here, nice. Okay, I think my chances are slim. Research complete. Not of completing research, as it turns out, that's fine. That's grand. Just the chances of completing the level and getting to the getting to the core. Uh, very slim. Okay, let's uh, let's reverse out. Let's go to the market. Oh, look at this! I love the I love the auto earner. It's so handy. Purchasing this item will instantly grant you plus twenty drill power. I'll take it. I, I, I don't love it. Uh, I guess coratorium. Yep. Let's go and do that because I now know that we can get our H, uh, HQ upgrade size increased. What do we got here? Auto wool, uh, auto gold earner. Cool. I don't want to say that we've basically done it, but we've basically almost unlocked the, the, the last quadrant here. So we've got two additional two additional rooms that we can unlock. The library might end up being more valuable than that. So let's get... I'm not going to do the full sapphire just in case. Uh, right. So library 60... The library is slightly better from a perspective of, of crit uh, crit strike. And then this is also slightly better than the other one. Do we need to deploy anyone? Yeah, we totally do. You are muscle. We have loads of spaces for muscle, surely. Cool. Any, any upgrades? We certainly do. Uh, we are very, very close to... We are very, very, very close to our corp level, and we're probably going to hit it, if I'm not mistaken. There we go. Let's get this upgraded now. Oh, -ho! 45k and an employee. Oh, that's brilliant. I presume you can... Yeah, you can work there. Drill power plus 120? That's huge. That's absolutely monstrous. That's really, really good. Uh, yeah, hold up. You are... You're a scientist. Let me go into the, the garage uh, real quick and just have a little look at your perks. Power-ups break quicker. Power-up crates break faster. That's not bad. It's, it's, it's fine. Absolutely fine. Let's continue upgrading in the collection. Get all of these freaking upgrade points. I mean, is there... Is there anything I can do about these upgrade points? Like, I mean... Surely they've got to be useful for someone else, right? Surely. The upgrade points that I can get in the garage uh, as well, I should mention. 
Cool, cool. And Ice Thread. Nice. Uh, okay, that leaves us with 75k. Probably need more science before doing anything. But to be fair, our cash did just increase tremendously. We need 40, we need more Polar Stone. Uh, yeah, let's let's have a little look on the minimap. Let's go exploring. Let's finish out this area. This area is probably quite cheap to finish. Check that crew contract in just a second. Research facility. Great that. Get, get that. Uh, you need radishes. Let's track space radishes because Mr. Banny, Banny Han will be able to get that very, very soon indeed. Let's go minimap. Let's go down here. Then I think that we can probably, probably focus on the absolute garbage. Literally the worst tiles that I think that you could possibly, possibly get. Okay, fine. Uh, Mr. Banahan, we need uh, we need space radishes. Let's let's go and let's go and specifically look out for space radishes. We have been somewhere where they were fairly prevalent. Shroom and bulge, whatever. We'll go we'll go bulge, I guess. Have we completed? Have we completed this planet? I don't know. Also, my HP seems to have increased by like a thousand since the last time I was. I was around. I think that we might have completed this planet, actually. Perhaps not super ideal. Oh, that's Hades Blight there. Space Radishes, that should be enough. Right, let's head down. Well, maybe I haven't completed this planet. This is a pretty... This is a... Pretty, yeah, this is a pretty, this is a pretty mean environment. Uh, but I actually think that we can do this. I actually think that with the upgrades that we've received, we can, we can do a lot of planets now. There we go. I shouldn't really use my boost until we get down past the... Ah, that was a shame. Uh, yeah, I shouldn't use my boost until I get down past the lair when... Ah, yep, got it. Nice. Thanks thanks to that crit there. Uh, yeah, the layer when the acid starts to take effect. There we go. Go, 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 We're losing HP so fast. Oh, my lordy. Oh, we got it. We absolutely got it. Nice. That's it completed. Good stuff. Go to HQ. And that's going to get us our next crew member, if I'm not mistaken. Again, crew members have got to be the best, right? Like they're they're the biggest and the the biggest and the most important. Space radishes no longer need to be tracked, but check for upgrades just in case. Ice chamber, yeah, sure you can go in here. Pretty decent, pretty pretty decent. Okay, now what is next? Anything at the garage? No, not particularly. Do I want to do a little bit of exploration or do I want to just... Do I want to just save for this? Where is it? Uh, yeah, this drill hanger up here. That's the thing. Welcome to the hangar. 65,000 65, and a little bit more research. Yeah, I can try and do a couple of additional, a couple of additional planets, even if I'm not super. Oh, I picked a good planet, clearly. Uh, even if I'm not super convinced that it's going to work, or I need to. Even if I'm not super convinced that I'm going to be able to get to the core, it's at least worth a punt, purely because we can pick up useful resources, of course, like Polar Stone, but more importantly, we can get the research that we need and the money that we need in order to get. Ooh. Now that, I like that. Perhaps a little too rare for my taste at the moment, given that that's the first time that I've seen it and I've played a fair bunch uh, since. Uh, okay, apparently this is going to be an absolute walk in the park. 
because we got the ice chamber or whatever it's called. But there's still another level after this, so might as well get this out of the way, then then redo. It's shocking, honestly, like returning to shocking returning to previous levels. Wow. It's shocking returning to previous levels and figuring out just how easy they actually are in uh, in retrospect. Right, let's uh, let's leave drill site. Let's redo. I like horizontal bars. I, I like horizontal bars a lot. Some good cash that we're making out of this uh, out of this planet. Four thousand HP on the drill. That is quite remarkable. Man, these crits. These crits are so good. The fact that they instantly destroy everything around you is so nice. Okay, maybe this isn't super rare. Nice. Cash multiplier. I'll take it. Plus five. Oh, yes. Now, that's, that's pretty good. Hopefully, the crits are in my favor. Okay, we are not going to make this... We're not going to make this... Uh, we're not going to make this journey. Why not just... Do a little bit of exploration instead. See what we can find. Good stuff. That's excellent, in fact. 63,000. Yeah, I actually want to go back up. Believe it or not, getting that five times crit multiplier really changes the, the way that I think we approach this game. Or approach this level in particular. There is an elemental shield there, which is kind of nice. But chests and just general drilling are the name of the the name of the game. Because then if we do if we do chests and we get something like this, then that just that takes us into, you know, just silly money territory. I mean, this is the first 100,000 plus run that I have achieved. Yeah. And there's more. Oh, there's more. Oh, there is more. More to come. Let's take the chest. Every every you know occasional tile seems to be seems to be a nice juicy crit for us as well. So not only is this going to be the first a hundred thousand plus run, there is a very very decent chance that it's going to be a two hundred thousand plus run. Oh, you've got to love you've got to love the five times score multiplier. Oh, you have to love it. Three hundred thousand. It's probably pushing a little bit. Oh, yeah. Maybe not with that health uh, bonus. Things get easier when we get up to the top of the world as well. Like, it gets easier to... gets easier to cut through things. Okay, another one of those sunshine fellows. We are... We are in a great place. More chests. More items. More money. Where are we? We're nine kilometers from the surface. Good crit, good crit. I think we're gonna hit I think we're gonna hit 300k, and I don't even think it's gonna be close. 5.4 money multiplier. Wow, I have never, ever, ever got that before. And if I have, I certainly have never got as much out of it as I'm getting out of it now. Okay. Oh my lordy. I just wish I could boost through this faster. Oh my goodness gracious me. Now, I'm assuming that we don't have a research multiplier as well. So I'm assuming that it's literally just cash that we're transforming into five times more valuable at the moment. But I could be wrong. I could be wrong about that. 400,000? This is, this is crazy. Okay, we've definitely hit 400,000. This has got to be, this has got to be the most nice work champ. I bet we'll do even better next time. 
yeah, that was, um, that was crazy. That was absolutely bonkers. Uh, right, that rather changes the playstyle a little bit. Um, that was really, really good. Okay, let's, let's see. 1,200. Nice! Hey, that's a, that's a, a back end to a drill. That's good. We're gonna, we're gonna go and pick that up. Good thing that I got the, the money there. It's gonna come in super handy for pretty much everything. Right, so... XP modifier is, is large. Power up chance increase, cash multiplier plus 20%. I guess I'll take the power up, the, the power up situation. Light radius, light radius. Um, minor fish lawyer. I think I still want that combo. Minor fish and lawyer. Yeah, I, I think I still want. I think I still want this uh, this crew. It's gonna be. I mean, it's no no big difference really, is it? I mean, the cash multiplier is gonna be slightly less, but that's okay. Again, still very, very fine with keeping this drill. No point in spending all of those upgrade tokens on something else. Yeah, totally fine with that. Okay, that cash is is just crazy. Oh, that cash word. is just absolutely Seriously. bonkers. Right, research. Anything in the research departments? Full Sapphire, Bleak Boulder. We're not going to do the full Sapphire, just in case. Just in case, by some weird, insane reason, we've got enough to get a contract in place. Pretty sure we don't. More Polar Stone, more Fool's Sapphire. Yeah, okay, all right, let's, uh, let's, let's look at the minimap, and let's, uh, let's continue to evaluate where we're gonna go. I'll tell you what I'd like to do. Let's get the bottom of this, let's get the bottom of this area done. I suspect that we probably have the cash to do it. Crew contracts, very good, let's, Man, I am so happy that we got the exploration cost reduction. Right, chest, decent. Research, decent. Chest, pretty decent. Crew contract. Th that's got to be, that's got to be like area two stuff, right? Like that's, that's got to be, that's got to be sector two. Right. I mean, for the first time in, well, any time. Investments. 10 fire resistance. Eh. A full explore of the sector is now officially on the cards. It's probably just a little bit too pricey for me, though. Yeah, a little bit too pricey. Little smidgeroony too pricey, but that's uh, that's not the end of the world. Okay, should we should we try and max out one of these one of these uh, one of these moons or one of these comets? If they're just comets, we can maybe we can maybe think about doing them. Right, I am expecting like just an insane amount of power ups because at the end of the day we we ordered and we've got the we've got the back end. Actually, no, we don't have the back end, which increases our power up chance. Because I'm pretty sure that was green. Go, 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 go. Health is looking just fine. It is a long way to go, though. Hence, if we could get some crits or some, uh, some HP, that would be grand. Thank you. Good stuff. And we're going to boost. Hey, there we go. We did it. This is the last one as well, if, uh, if I'm not mistaken. Not bad. Cool. We got the core. What a breeze, indeed. It's, uh... There we go. Brilliant. And that's it. And that should give us a decent amount of, uh, of core fragments, too. Right, 46k. Let's... 
Let's go gas giant thing. Let's go gas giant thing. In fact, let's not go gas giant thing. Let's finish off this area. Market stock, wonderful. Okay, pretty sure that's all that we can really do. Okay. Uh, right. Pancakes, pancakes. Pancakes, pancakes, and more damned pancakes. Oh my goodness. I, I love that horizontal beam thing. It's so... It's so good. Right, this is a fire gas giant. It does feel chill, though. It does feel very, very chill. Light? I will take light. Uh, yeah, it's nice. Bit inconvenient, because I'm looking to try and... Oh, that's handy. Looking to try and max out the, uh, the core. Again, shouldn't be using boost until I get to the very bottom. Might not even need it, to be honest. Man, I love that crit. I love that crit. What was this? 10 multiplier? Uh, I'll take it whilst I'm here. It's pretty good. Might not even need the boost, to be honest. Oh my goodness. Makes me glad that I took the multiplier when I did. go and we press ever further onwards right oh hold up we gotta contractually obliged to take this so good it just gets gets you so much money headlamp boost let's go don't think that we're going to have the HP to do this. Very, very close. Bit of a shame. Bit of a shame there. That's uh, that's not a problem. I mean, that, that just tells me that the gas giant is just a little too big for us at the moment. Gimbal. We will do gimbal, I guess. I kind of really want to see if we can try and... Oh, that was... There we go. I saw it at the corner of my eye. I really do want to see if we can try and explore the entirety of... See if we can try and explore the entirety of the map. Or at least the entirety of the quadrant. Okay. 20% HP increase. It's uh, not bad at all. Fool's Gold. Very, very handy. We still need it for contracts. Still. I don't want to say desperately in need of it, but we do need it. That's a nice little boost. Nice and handy. Whoa. Flip the neck. Alright, boost, 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 boost. Get away. Fool's gold. No. Oh, really? For real? We we had that there, actually. That's, uh, that's a bit of a shame. If I didn't encounter those enemies at the bottom... just fine. All right, keep boosting down. There's no elemental nonsense to worry about, and also there's a boost recharge station, so not exactly penalized for, for boosting. Boosting a lot, that is. Oh my goodness. I want to see if I can try and kill that thing with dynamite, actually. That would be kind of cool. Gotta take it. something in here. Uh, just research. Not saying that it's bad, just not saying that I really care about it. Oh, come on, video game. Come on. I've definitely got the core in my sights. A few less of those... <sighs> A few less of those sandy-looking tiles would be, would be nice, though, because they are pretty bad. Uh, yeah, this is a bit of a write-off. I, I hit the enemies early on, and, uh... Well, they, they are nasty. And also, these enemies are hitting me again, and more sandy tiles. Oh. Yeah. Health. No. Ah, goodness gracious me. 
I mean, we, we need a little bit more boost to get past these to get past these chumps. Makes you makes you think really. Maybe we should be prioritizing boost from the market as opposed to spending the rest of my money on you know other stuff. The thing is though, is that I know I know that this level is imminently doable with the uh, with the equipment that we've got. I'll take it. Very very doable. Nice. Fool's gold. Sideways a little bit. Boost past. Okay, we're at 63. Absolutely cannot hit any more of those purple tiles. Flip an egg. Oh my goodness. Okay, uh, clearly this is not going to happen. 180k though is is very very respectable. It's gonna allow us to get the super expensive tiles out here. Crew contract, love to see it. That's why we explore it there. Is that a sausage roll? Anything? More polar stone. Still nothing on that one. We check this crew contract. Pretty sure that I did. Oh, another planet out here. Well. Twugon, we will we will drill. I think we're gonna need to make a concerted effort on the second sector soon, actually. There we go. Or the second quadrant, even. Not the second sector. Easy. Very, very easy. Okay, let's go. Let's go again. Cup of tea. Don't think that there's anything particularly interesting. Nice. I mean that it's you know equipment like the uh, like the dynamite and the horizontal line, which just give you such an inordinate amount of exploding potential that it just takes it just takes your research up by like a, a tremendous amount. There we go. All right, core level two. Very easy. We can give core level three a shot, I guess. No, no harm in trying. An old can. We're getting to the stage where we can pretty much just come in and ace a ace a planet. I'd like to do more of that though. Man, the gravity, the gravity is, uh, the gravity is tough here. It's something. Oh boy, it's something. My prospects are slim. Ah, we did not do bad. We did not do bad there. I'll, I'll take that. That's a, it's a pretty decent, pretty decent victory. Let's check out what's in the shop. I'm pretty sure that there's two things in the shop that we haven't checked out. What is this? Nano drill. Auto mine any location that you've already visited. Uh, what? From the astronomy screen. Nano drills available. Deploy one. Oh my freaking goodness. Wait, what do we need? What do we need for our contracts? I mean... We should just deploy this on... Sure. What does it do? Does it... I guess we'll... I guess we'll see what it does in like 100 seconds. I mean, we gotta... We gotta leave a little longer just to see what the heck happens, right? Or we gotta leave the, the episode running just a smidgen longer just to see what happens. Drill power plus 10%? Yeah, I'll take that. It's a pretty big increase. Acid resistance. I don't care about acid resistance. Fire resistance. Not super bothered. Auto winner gold. Auto winner gold. Drill power plus 20%. Okay, I mean, that is that is absolutely huge. Let's go into the, the garage here. Yeah, I'll... I'll... I'll leave it on the, uh, the the green one for now. Let's go collection, because I know that there's a couple of upgrades here. And I know that these couple of upgrades are going to allow us to get uh, an unlock. That's handy, because I need a better drill, and uh, I don't want to do this one. Now, that is, that is better. 
Yeah, so this is 140. This, yeah, this is way better. This is, like, so much better. It's not even funny. Uh, yeah. Okay, that's, that's, that's great. I'm super, super, super happy with that. That takes our... That takes our drill to a truly great location. And it's now feeling... Feeling really good. Any upgrades for our crew? 35k. Uh, you are 30k. You are 29k. So we can get some upgrades, but we're we're a little a little ways away from actually doing that. Um, I am gonna check whilst we're waiting for this nano drill to run. What are our contracts? Call site and copper bar. Polar stone track. Polar stone. Yeah, literally polar stone actually. Wow, we're getting some decent we're getting some decent gold from uh from our auto earner. Right, polar stone where? Still two moons that we can find it on, or a moon and a something else that we can find it on. Power ups should be spawning much more regularly. We're looking for power stone. The drill's power is pretty pretty good. Power stone, what am I talking about? Polar stone. Health, it's good. Oh, no, nothing. No sign of any. No sign of any stone. Cash multiplier is a little bit more lame. You can just about tolerate that though. We're at 76 kilometers down, and uh, we're, we're facing some roadblocks here. Oh, that's good, though. That's real good. Uh, we're going to utilize that very, very soon. That's what we came for. This is also what we came for. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, let's, let's go and reheal. Now that is great. Uh, we probably want to just get the shard first, right? Or get the, uh, yeah, get the shards, get the core. Get that out of the way. Then we can turn our attention to finding some polar stone. After we don't have to worry about the super crippling cold, uh, or the super crippling gravity and the super crippling cold. Right, good stuff. So there's at least one polar stone around. Weirdly, it's, it's not one of these situations where the deeper it gets, the more common it is to... To get it it's just pretty uncommon in general apparently that's fine though I can can tolerate that good stuff and we shall press upwards just in case there is polar stone up here even though Oh, even though there is, even though there is two, two polar stone. Right, we'll drill one more time. I don't think that there's a core here, is there? Pretty sure that this is... Actually, no, tell a lie, this is level three. So there could still very well be a core here. I really haven't been paying much attention at all. Go. 20% HP, good. It's quite handy. Even more HP. Oh my goodness gracious me. The power up increase is very cool. Full boost. Very good. Keep it coming, keep it coming, keep it coming, keep it coming, keep it coming. Nice. That's Polar Stone right there. We gotta go, we gotta go for it gonna take literally half my HP to mine, but super worthwhile endeavor. There is no core here. It's totally fine. Totally fine with that. Uh, if only I could find some more of this gosh darned this gosh darned stone. There's gotta be a planet where it's more common. It might be in the second might be in the second galaxy though. 
All right, two more. That's fine. Go to HQ. Uh, we got 13. I'm pretty sure it's 15 that we need in order to in order to make it work. Uh, return timer. Nano drill return. Let's go to astronomy. Collect. What do we got? Oh, that's nice. That's nice. So it's not great. It's not brilliant, but it's it's far from terrible. Uh, so can I find... Oh, I don't know. Whatever the planet is. Yeah, the, the planet that gives me this. Let's deploy the nano drill here. So it re literally returns in like five minutes. Oh, that's that's so that's so sick. Coratorium, let's uh let's take the drill power upgrade. It's not a drill power upgrade. It's an auto earner increase, which it's not bad, but it's, it's not it's not what I was really looking for. Okay, 127 or 125,000 or whatever. Uh let's see if we can try and get the rest of the galaxy explored. There surely cannot be... Well, there is there is a bunch of stuff that we need to do, but it's it's actually uh, not super expensive. Two, four, six, seven crew contracts. Two, four, six, seven. Yeah, so we've got them all. That's a planet. Okay. Comet the Join. That's a pretty unique... Uh, pretty unique name for a comet. Just gonna boost all the way down. Not even, not even close to being a challenge. There we go. Okay, literally didn't discover anything about what this planet's about, but, uh, but that's fine. I'm sure we will. Okay, bread, that's, uh, that's not particularly useful. XP, likewise. Uh, it's not super great. Uh, we do need to spend some of this money that we've got on upgrading our crew. There we go. Research complete. Excellent. We're going to drill again, and we're going to just max out this... Uh, we're going to max out this comet on the first go, by the looks of it. No horizontal beams, though. That's, that's a shame. Always a shame. Right. I think we're starting to get to the point, hopefully, where the amount of money that we collect on the run, or any run, in fact, is, uh, is a nice bonus to our income. Copper bars. Okay, copper bars are great, because I need copper bars for, like, a whole bunch of things. Uh, yeah, we're getting to the point where we need to where we need to start uh, we need to start shoring up the oh my lordy, uh, shoring up the auto earner income and hopefully, uh, you know, getting a lot more passive income rather than rather than taking back a whole bunch of money from mining trips. Not like taking money from mining trips or back from mining trips is bad. It's just uh, what we got to do. Copper bars, nice. Keep going, keep going, keep going. I'm going to do a little bit of exploration just to try and get just to try and get some more copper bars because uh, as I mentioned it is actually kind of handy uh, but that's just not whatever just not just not happening okay uh, we can go back to the map and that is all three levels immediately done we got 150,000 still on the go uh, Mushroom World, Shroom World. Now, this is a miserable place. This is an absolutely miserable place. I remember this place very, very well. Yep, already I'm at half HP. Brilliant. Oh, that's that's fantastic. Threading the needle is key here, clearly. But, I mean, how can you thread the needle? It's just it's ridiculous. At least let's get the research. Research. Explode here. Nope. Just, uh, just made it. Made it out alive. Not to mention the fact that it's a pretty inhospitable environment without the... I gotta take it. I gotta take it. Nice. That actually clears the way for getting through here. Alright, I'm, I'm surprised. Uh, I don't want to try this again, even though I think that we could do it. Yeah, screw that. All right, let's go. Let's go and buy out the rest of the. 
buy out the rest of the galaxy. There's literally nothing else to, to do up here. Good. Maybe one more planet in, in this quadrant. Chest. It's good. One more planet. One more crew contract. One more bag of flour. Close. We're close. We're close to getting that. Cost state. Okay, uh, let's let's go and see what's on Dog World. And by let's see what's on Dog World, I mean let's uh, let's go right the way through, and then let's get to the get to the ends. Boom, boom. This is a this is a hot environment. Yeah, we might not be able to. Might not be able to do this super easily, but certainly give it a punt. Oh yeah, I forgot. I know exactly what's going to be on Dog World. It's, it's pretty pretty abundantly obvious, actually. Oh, bucket of sand. Of course, a bucket of sand on on Dog World. It makes perfect sense. Go 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 go. Cash multiplier is good. Research complete. That's why we really came, you know. That is why we really came here. Are we gonna do this? Wow! Absolutely gonna do this, even though we're on fire. In a major way, uh, we're, we're gonna manage. Alright, run it back! Let me, let me see if we can try and complete Dog World. In fact, if I get maybe one singular HP boost, we might manage to... I managed to do it. That's also really, really handy, to be honest. Oh. That helps us a little bit. Probably not that much. That's my one HP upgrade that I was uh, that I was moaning about. Is it too early or is it just in time? Uh, would I have managed anyway? I I don't I don't know. I don't know if we would have. Uh, okay, go back to the map. I want to double check this contract. Uh, yeah, track flower. Sure. Right, we'll head back to the HQ. I honestly thought I was going to get an achievement for uh, for maxing out for maxing out a quadrant, but apparently not. Get this upgraded. Bucket of sand upgraded. We have got a lot of cash to spend in house. But most importantly, I want to spend... Yeah, that's pretty big. It's pretty big. What have we got here? Radiation resistance? I really don't care about that, to be honest, at all. It's such an irrelevant irrelevant thing. Uh, right, we have got a whole bunch of research to do here. Do I need to... Do I have any space to build any rooms, actually? No. No, we don't. So, the research it's kind of pointless to do right now. I mean, the fool's gold and stuff is gonna... Memory safety bank? Yeah, I don't want to do this research. I don't want to do this research yet because I, I know that it's just gonna end in disaster. Instead, let's go to the market. Nope. Nothing nothing in the market. That is very, very, very surprising. Uh, let's check out the crew. Oh man, do I want to spend I don't want to spend my I don't want to spend my hard-earned cash on the crew. That's for sure. Let's go to the, the garage and uh, increase our drill power. Drill power is now max. Which is brilliant. Let's check out astronomy. Now, polar stone? No polar stone. No freaking polar stone at all. I need to send. I need to send you off. There we go to another planet that's hopefully going to give us polar stone. Um, I think that that's pretty much it, though, right? Like, uh, there's a few other bits and bobs that we need to do, but obviously we will be getting to them in the next episode. What I'm most excited about is properly starting the, the beta quadrant. 
Uh, the only real issue is that things are super expensive to explore out here. And yeah, I'm, I'm able to explore like one tile at the moment because I've used up all of my cash. Uh, we'll get to that. We'll get to that in time, I'm sure. But for now, ladies and gents, we're going to wrap things up. Thank you ever so much for watching. Thanks to Banana Nana Nana and Aurelio from the $225 plus tier patrons. Thank you very much for watching, folks. I'll see you next time. Bye.